Hello everyone, welcome to today's class. So as all of you know that we are running a series of interview topics. So in today's class, we will be going to see how can we make a purchase organization a standard or central. So we have already discussed different type of purchasing organization. There we have discussed what is a standard purchase organization or what is a central purchase organization to give an overview to you. So when you are going to assign or when you are assigning the purchase organization to company code then it will act as a central purchase organization right so what is the need of a central purchase organization so central purchase organization are responsible for creating any kind of centrally agreed contract they can be responsible for creating those kind of contract so whenever you are creating a centrally agreed contract you can create a contract but you cannot provide an order on that basis of let's say contract you cannot create a purchase order to create a purchase order or contract release order you need to have a reference purchase organization assigned to your plant and that will be assigned to your let's say central purchase organization to make it as a reference purchase organization so that you will be able to create or you will be able to release a contract release order or create a purchase order with respect to your centrally agreed contract so that's it for today let's meet again on tomorrow till then bye bye and take care